This is Aprilia's RSV4, in my opinion one of the most beautiful motorcycles on the planet. Too bad then that it's absolutely slathered in warning labels. Thankfully, they're pretty easy to take off. I'll show you how in this video from the MC Garage. Wear a helmet. Don't ride drunk. Use premium gas. These are all pretty self-evident to any rider with half a brain, but manufacturers still have to slap these and lots of other warning labels on their product. Unfortunately for the end user, these decals look like crap. Thankfully, they're really easy to take off. All you need is a sunny day, a heat gun, or a hair dryer, a clean rag, and a gentle solvent like WD-40 or Goo Gone. First, heat up the decals to soften the adhesive. Do so with sweeping motions from a distance, making sure not to heat up the paint too much. Once the decal is warm, lift up a corner with your fingernail and peel it off at a 90 degree angle. This helps keep the decal from tearing and usually lifts the adhesive off cleanly. If there's still some glue left over once you've pulled the sticker off, put some solvent on your rag and gently wipe it away. Make sure you're using a clean rag, microfiber is the best since it's the softest, and don't rub too hard or you might haze the clear coat. So that's how you remove the decals that were applied at the factory, and the same technique applies to any stickers that you may have put on yourself. Now, before you go pulling off every decal on your bike, there are some stickers that you're going to want to keep. There's usually a VIN and an emissions compliance sticker somewhere on the frame or the fairing. You don't want to remove those. Also, the tire pressure and chain slack information label that's usually found on the rear fender or swing arm is pretty handy to have around. If you don't like the way it looks, you can remove it and place it somewhere out of sight. The RSV4 is a beautiful bike and I think it looks a whole lot better now that we've removed all those warning labels. I hope this video was helpful. Tune in in another two weeks for more tips and advice from the MC Garage.